Hello guys, how are you? I uploaded a video named GSM module using an old cell phone years ago and I received many requests for code and schematic diagram of that circuit. But I could not reply. I am sorry for that. But today I will tell you the working of that project. I don't remember the circuit exactly. But I will tell you how I made this circuit and how I reached to the idea of making this circuit. If you are an electronics guy, you can easily make it. But if you still have a, any problem, you encounter any problem, then you can ask me. And this time I am not going to make any delay for that. So before starting that, I will give you a brief idea about what my circuit does. This circuit can control anything from far distance, like a GSM module. When Whenever I call to this mobile, phone, this mobile phone, it will detect that it is coming from a master caller. What master caller means is that a specific mobile to which it's supposed to respond. And when it receives the call and detect that it is from master caller, it will cut the call and give miss call back to this master caller as a feedback feedback to show that it has performed its operation in my circuit the operation is turning on and off this led if you want to see all the demonstration of this project you can check my video i am putting one link in the description for that so one more thing it does is if any other caller does the calling to this mobile phone number any other other than master caller then it will not respond to that number so now let's go to the working of this project i notice one thing that whenever anyone calls us one thing happens that it vibrates so i thought of manipulating it for my purpose so i took one input from vibration vibration motor as you can see here there's a vibration motor and i'm taking out two uh, one input from this vibration motor and through the uh, op -amp as a comparator I interface it with the Arduino and by writing a simple code if else code actually I can perform my operation here you can see that one wire is coming I don't remember the exact circuit but it is uh, one input is from vibration motor is coming and uh, giving it input to this op -amp. and then after that this output is going into uh, this Arduino so this is it but here problem with this is that it will vibrate for every call so how would phone know that what should it respond to any fake call can come and it will uh, respond to that so uh, this is the problem so what can we do to remove this problem so some mobile has this functionality to block every number except one number but my mobile phone does not have this functionality so to put that intelligence into it i used one more input that is mobile phone ringing here there there was a speaker actually i removed it and i took input from here and through the comparator i interfaced it with the arduino again uh, this this one this is the output pin here a green one and uh, it is interfaced with this Arduino then what did I do is I put my mobile phone silent for every number except one specific number or a master number if my phone had this functionality of blocking every number except one that it I would have not used ring input I use this ring input just to make it specific to a particular number only so to make it respond to only one number so here first part is done now let's come to the second part that is cutting off the call and giving miss call back to this master caller as a feedback so as I told you that once it detect that uh, the call is coming from master caller then it will cut off the call and then it will turn this LED on and after that the mobile phone will this mobile phone will give feedback to the master caller it will uh, give a missed call actually as a feedback so how did I uh, make it happen so let's come to that part also for this purpose I took input from a keypad if you see keypad carefully you will see it is just a simple switch simple switch like here 
it is a simple switch which shows these two metal contacts these two metal contacts when it is pressed so i solder two wire to these metal contact and made them short using a transistor and arduino uh, here only you are seeing here only one wire but there were two wire for one for this metal contact and one for this one but uh, it has been a long time so it automatically got disconnected so here you are you can see the keypad wire is connected through this transistor and, and further it is interfaced with this arduino and i wrote simple code for that and the second i use speed dialing for calling back so this is how this circuit work i have given you idea and i hope you can make it now if you are a really electronics guy and you love playing around with electronics so definitely you can make it but still you have any doubt you can query and i will give you a response thank you so much